Welcome, curious minds, to the shadowy realm of digital threats. In this journey, we will explore the unseen and often misunderstood world of computer viruses, those silent saboteurs lurking in the depths of our digital lives. Today, we delve into the annals of computer history to uncover the origins of a silent saboteur, the computer virus. These malicious codes have evolved over the decades, but their roots trace back to a time when computers were just beginning to enter the public consciousness. Imagine a world before antivirus software, where the very machines designed to simplify our lives could be turned against us. In those early days, the concept of a computer virus was as foreign as the idea of the internet itself. This is where our story begins, with the emergence of the first polymorphic computer virus known as 1260. This virus was a pioneer in the world of digital threats, capable of changing its code to avoid detection, much like a chameleon blending into its surroundings. Like an ancient artifact whispering forgotten secrets, 1260 offers a glimpse into the dawn of digital contagion. It was a time when the digital landscape was still uncharted territory, and the rules of engagement were being written in real time. Our journey takes us back to a time when computers were behemoths, occupying entire rooms and speaking in the cryptic language of punch cards. These machines, though primitive by today's standards, were the foundation upon which our modern digital world was built. Yet, even in these early days, a new breed of digital outlaw was emerging. Hackers, driven by curiosity, ambition, or perhaps a touch of mischief. These pioneers of the digital underworld were the first to see the potential for both creation and destruction within the binary code. It was in this environment that the 1260 virus first reared its head a harbinger of the digital threats to come. This virus, with its ability to mutate and evade detection, was a sign of the complex and ever-evolving nature of cyber threats that we continue to face today. As we move forward in our exploration, we will uncover more about how these early viruses shaped the cybersecurity landscape and the ongoing battle between those who create and those who protect. The year was 1987, a time when the world was on the cusp of a technological revolution. Personal computers were just beginning to find their place in homes, transforming the way we worked, played, and communicated. Businesses around the world were also embracing this new technology, integrating it into their daily operations and workflows. But in the shadows, a digital predator lurked, waiting to strike at the heart of this burgeoning digital landscape. The 1260 virus, so named for the boot sector size it infected, spread silently, moving from one machine to another with a stealth that was both impressive and terrifying. Its true nature was masked by its polymorphic abilities, allowing it to change its code and evade detection by the rudimentary antivirus software of the time. The discovery of 1260 is shrouded in mystery, with many details lost to the mists of time and the fog of digital war. Its origins remain unknown, a puzzle that has intrigued and baffled cybersecurity experts for decades. Some whisper of a lone programmer toiling away in a darkened room, driven by a desire to test the limits of this new digital frontier. Others speak of a group of mischievous hackers, eager to push the boundaries and see just how far they could go in this uncharted territory. These hackers, often seen as digital outlaws, were both feared and admired for their skills and audacity. Whatever its genesis, the 1260 virus marked a turning point in the history of computing, a moment when the world realized the potential dangers lurking within our digital creations. It forced us to confront the vulnerability of our digital systems, sparking a new era of cybersecurity and vigilance that continues to evolve to this day. The 1260 virus, a pioneer in its own right, introduced the world to the concept of polymorphism. Unlike its simpler brethren, which relied on static code, 1260 possessed the ability to change its appearance with each infection. This digital chameleon could evade detection by even the most sophisticated antivirus software of the time, making it a formidable adversary in the digital realm. 1260 spread primarily through infected floppy disks, the lifeblood of data transfer in the early days of personal computing. Once an infected disk was inserted into a computer, the virus would spring to life, attaching itself to the boot sector, the very heart of the machine's operating system. From this strategic vantage point, 1260 could wreak havoc, corrupting files, deleting data, and even rendering entire systems unusable. The emergence of the 1260 virus sent shockwaves through the nascent computing community. It was a stark reminder that the digital world, like the physical one, was not immune to malicious actors. The virus spread rapidly, infiltrating homes, businesses, and even government institutions. The impact of 1260 was significant. It highlighted the vulnerability of early computer systems, which lacked the sophisticated security measures we take for granted today. 
The virus forced programmers and security experts to rethink their approach, leading to the development of the first antivirus programs. Section 5. A New Era of Awareness Lessons from 1260 The 1260 virus, though a disruptive force, ultimately served as a catalyst for change. It ushered in a new era of awareness about the importance of computer security, forcing us to acknowledge the potential consequences of digital threats. The lessons learned from 1260 continue to shape the digital landscape today. It underscored the importance of robust antivirus software, regular system updates, and safe computing practices. It also highlighted the need for collaboration and information sharing within the cybersecurity community to stay ahead of emerging threats. Section 6. The Legacy of 1260 a catalyst for change. The legacy of the 1260 virus is complex and multifaceted. On the one hand, it represents a dark chapter in the history of computing, a reminder of the vulnerability of our digital creations. Yet, it also serves as a testament to human ingenuity and our ability to adapt and innovate in the face of adversity. The emergence of 1260 sparked a technological arms race, pitting security researchers against an ever-evolving array of digital threats. It led to the development of sophisticated antivirus software, intrusion detection systems, and other security measures that continue to protect our digital lives today. Section 7. Beyond 1260. The evolution of malware. The 1260 virus, though a pioneer in its own right, was just the tip of the iceberg. In the years that followed, the world witnessed an explosion of new and increasingly sophisticated malware threats, each more cunning and destructive than the last. From worms that spread like wildfire across networks to ransomware that holds our data hostage, the threat landscape has evolved significantly since the days of 1260. Yet, the lessons learned from this early digital adversary continue to inform our approach to cybersecurity, reminding us that the battle against malware is an ongoing one. Section 8. The Unending Arms Race Cybersecurity in the Modern Age Today, the battle against malware rages on a constant game of cat and mouse between security professionals and cyber criminals. The digital landscape has expanded exponentially since the days of 1260, encompassing everything from personal computers to smartphones, tablets, and even internet-connected devices in our homes and cars. With each new technological advancement comes a corresponding increase in the sophistication and audacity of cyber attacks. From nation-state actors engaged in cyber espionage to criminal organizations seeking financial gain, the motivations and capabilities of those who would do us harm in the digital realm are vast and varied. Section 9. Staying ahead of the curve. Protecting our digital lives. In this ever-evolving threat landscape, staying ahead of the curve is paramount. Protecting our digital lives requires a multifaceted approach, encompassing everything from robust cybersecurity software and regular system updates to a healthy dose of digital hygiene. Educating ourselves about the latest threats, practicing safe browsing habits, and being wary of suspicious emails and attachments are all critical components of a strong cybersecurity posture. By taking proactive steps to protect ourselves, we can mitigate the risk of falling victim to the ever-present threat of malware. Section 10. The Future of Cybersecurity. A Call to Action. As we venture further into the digital age, the importance of cybersecurity will only continue to grow. With every passing day, our reliance on digital platforms and technologies deepens, making the need for robust cybersecurity measures more critical than ever before. The future of our digital lives, and indeed our very way of life, depends on our ability to stay one step ahead of those who would seek to exploit our vulnerabilities. Cyber threats are evolving at an unprecedented pace, and it is imperative that we remain vigilant and proactive in our defense strategies. The fight against malware is a collective one, requiring collaboration and information sharing across individuals, organizations, and governments. No single entity can combat these threats alone. It is through our combined efforts that we can hope to create a resilient digital infrastructure. By working together, we can create a safer and more secure digital world for ourselves and for generations to come. This means not only developing advanced technological solutions, but also fostering a culture of cybersecurity awareness and education. Remember, the artifacts of the past, like the 1260 virus, hold valuable lessons for the present and the future. These historical examples provide us with insights into the tactics and techniques used by cybercriminals, allowing us to anticipate and counteract future threats more effectively. By understanding the evolution of cyber threats, we can better equip ourselves to face the challenges that lie ahead. This involves continuous learning and adaptation, as well as staying informed about the latest developments in the field of cybersecurity. Until next time, stay curious, stay vigilant, and stay 